11.4 will allow you to view the ICD-9 diagnosis and the corresponding ICD-10 diagnosis within the problem list. A problem can then be further refined by right-click function over the problem, choosing Refine Problem, which will then give you a more specific diagnosis list related to that problem. If a diagnosis is not present, you can choose Search for a New Problem, and this will allow you other options consistent with that problem to be selected. Choosing the active problem through the ACI will allow you to refine your search. Multiple diagnosis related to the search will be present. You can then choose the plus sign next to a specific diagnosis and that will expand other options to give a more selective diagnosis for that problem. Eleven point four gives you the ability to establish your priority of use for a specific diagnosis in the active problem list. Once a problem is in the active list, right clicking over the problem will then allow you to choose add to my priority. This will then make that diagnosis a priority diagnosis on all of your problem lists throughout each patient. To create a folder for your problem diagnosis, you must be in the active tab of the ACI, right clicking over the body of the active diagnosis, choosing organize favorites, choose new group, You can then highlight each specific diagnosis using the control key will allow you to select multiple diagnosis. Then you can drag and drop into that folder. And when that folder is open, the diagnosis that are on the favorites list will now be grouped under the desired group heading. Another option to add a diagnosis to a group folder is to choose Organize favorites with right-click function. You can then select the diagnosis which has been saved to favorites. Choose move. Choose the appropriate folder. Choose OK. And this will add that diagnosis to the group folder. Allscripts 11.4 allows you to create folders that you can place multiple orderable items in for easy ordering. Once you're in the ACI tab, make sure that the quick set icon is turned to off. This will allow all of your favorites that you have listed to be visible. Then choosing right click over the body of the note, organize favorites, choose new order group, Label the folder, choose close, then choose the appropriate orderable item with right click, add to favorites, then choose the appropriate folder that was just created, choose add, and this will place that folder within the favorites tab. You can then choose another tab such as radiology making sure that the quick set icon is turned to off. Then choose the orderable item with right click function. Add to favorites. Then choose the appropriate folder. Choose add. This will place that folder within the favorites. When you click on the icon, you will see that both the lab test and the image are within that folder. These can then be ordered separately or by choosing the box left to the folder will order all the items within that folder. In 11.2, all discussion about a particular problem had to be completed in the discussion summary section of the note. 
11.4 will allow you to document an impression for each specific problem. To assess a problem, check the note icon to the left of the problem. To enter a specific impression, choose the pencil icon next to the problem being discussed. You can now enter your current impression. If a impression is present from a previous visit, it will be documented in the box to the left. If you desire to copy that information to the current impression, choosing copy last will move this information to the current impression. If you want to suppress and resolve, you can choose a specific date. Then choosing suppress on resolve will then move that from the problem list. Once information is recorded in the current impression, you can then visualize that information in the node by choosing view in the bottom left hand corner and this information will then be attached to the specific diagnosis. Spell check has been added to 11.4. Choosing spell check at the bottom tab will then select words that need to be corrected. 